Hi everybody, welcome to my vlog. Uh, today I just wanted to talk about, you know, the people that have come before you and paved the way for you, essentially. Um, you know, obviously we can talk about historians and, you know, Rosa Parks and Abraham Lincoln and this and that, um, but I want to talk about somebody personal to me, and that's my grandmother, my Italian grandmother. And she passed away 12 years ago, um, 11, almost 12 years ago, and um, she really, you know, I, I grew up with her essentially because my grandfather had passed away when I was younger and about junior high going into high school, and so she moved in with us, and she definitely paved the way and, and explained a lot of things to me. Um, you know, there was one point she <laughs> crushed a bee, and I, I got so freaked out, I was like, I can't believe that you just crushed that in your hand, and she looked at me and said, these hands have been through so much. She said, they're calloused, they're burned, I didn't even feel it. She said, they've been through so much, and then she told me stories of when, you know, she was growing up, and. Um, her mom was getting abused by her father and her mom filed for divorce. We're talking in the 1940s and her mom filed for divorce because she said, my five daughters are not going to see this and I'm not going to raise this them this way and I'm going to pave the way for them to make better decisions. And she did. And, and just in stories like that, it, may, it inspired me to, you know, remember things that she had been through, remember things that my great grandmother had been through, even though I didn't know her that well, but the stories that my grandmother had told me had resonated with me. Um, remember the people that have come before you, either in your family or, um, you know, or historians, you know, they've paved a way for you to do what you want and for you to have the freedom to make your own choices. Um, try to make the right choices, listen to what they were saying, you know, I mean, they had lived hardships but they still overcame them. So um, I really respect and I really value the time that I had with my grandmother before she passed away. I have tattoos on my arms for her. I love her. Um, and I will continue, her words and her wisdom will continue to live with me forever. Um, so if you like what I had to say, hit the like button, subscribe. Uh, follow me on Twitter at Joe underscore Lorenzo. If you comment here, I absolutely will comment back.